Welcome back to the channel once again, fam. I'm your host, Baritone Bliss. That I can answer that question is by telling the bombinicious story. It's a true story. See, there was this white family lived in Mississippi, and they had this man who worked for them occasionally named Bominicious. And he did various small jobs for them on and off for about a week. One night, he had just finished bartending the party, and the lady of the house realized that she didn't have any money. So she said to him, Bominicious, I, I want to write you a check, but I, I don't know how to spell Bominicious. <laughs> And he said, well, I've been meaning to talk to you about that. See, when I came to work for you, I told you my name, and then I said, but you can call me by my initials. Everybody around here call me Bomb Initials. Fine, you call me that. Don't even worry about it. Everybody call me Bomb Initials. Everybody call you Bomb Initials. Yeah, everybody in the whole city call me Bomb Initials. Don't even worry about it. It's fine. You call me that. Don't even worry about it. Bomb Initials. This is what everybody call Yeah, everybody call me that, man. Don't worry about it. I'm like, all right, so all week long, my ass talking about Bomb Initials, what up, boy? Hey, Bomb Initials, you gonna run and run, come over here and watch, watch the game with us later on? Hey, Bomb Initials, run to the store, grab some beer, come on back. My cousin said, what you calling him? <laughs> Bomb Initials. He said, everybody call him Bomb Initials. It's all right for me to call him that. Like, nah, man, it ain't CJ. He's saying you could call me by my initials. That's what he's saying. English. There's that hypocritical part that I was referring to. And, well, it's a lot easier to point out the hypocrisies in another person than it is in ourselves because I don't think any of us have the uh, clemency to just outright call somebody that. But... That's not the point, right? Yeah, it's not. Because we do we all knew that that was going to happen. I don't know. I still feel like it's six in one hand, half a dozen in the other. I feel like if you don't like it, just don't like it. And it's just as simple as that. There's a lot of stuff I don't like. I'm not going to sit here and blast it, but it is what it is, dog. I ain't expecting nobody to be like me. But lastly, someone else called him out. As pinning, they always proven how you don't have to be smart or educated to be successful. Because the original book, book, book and movie is a black love story. Stop being a loser. It's more than a black queer love story. And that that's exactly what I mean. If you have this mentality that you're going to take part of something and make it push your narrative, you're just as wrong as the person you point the finger at. People like me, I don't care either which way. Frankly, we all know that the original story told a much deeper story than that. But it's too deep. It's too, it's too deep. It's going to go over a lot of people's heads. Y'all ain't ready. We're going to start a podcast or something one day and see how this goes. Tell me if y'all be interested in seeing a little something like that. But we can go a little bit deeper on purpose. I shouldn't have said that. Anyway, that's all we got for you this time around, fam. But you already know your job's not done. Let us know what you think about it down in the comment section below and whether you think, well, like every other American is entitled to his opinion. Or if you think maybe that opinion should just be kept to himself since we already know what his stance is and maybe he should stop creating these situations, which will lead to him not being very true to himself, right? Yeah, it's, it's sticky. That's what I meant. It gets deep. But let me know what you guys make of it down in the comment section. And while you're there, if you're enjoying what the boys are bringing you, take just a couple of seconds of your time to smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and ring a ding ding that bell so that you too can stay up to date with the latest and greatest. Because you know that's all we got for you, right? Right. We've been Dirt TV Celebrity Media. You guys have been great as always. Keep it locked here for the latest stories, the latest breaking news, and the latest updates. And you know we got you covered. But still, do me that favor between now and then. Be sure to be safe at all times. Until next time, and we'll see you then. Peace.